Hi, I'm Jesse. I'm a property manager in the hospitality industry, and I give WhatsApp a uh, four out of five. Before WhatsApp, I have used Viber, Facebook Messenger, Slack, and while all the all those products are great, they really didn't fit our needs because they solved some of our issues, but not all of them. WhatsApp ended up meeting all of our requirements because it allowed us to communicate with each other internally as a company and with others outside of our network. Uh, it allows us to contact our guests, it allows us to contact each other, and a lot of times uh, our properties don't have good cell reception, so we're able to hop on Wi-Fi and communicate via WhatsApp, and uh, we can do video calls, we can submit pictures, and, and do all kind of other things that we sort of need a uh, multimedia messenger for. It was straightforward to integrate WhatsApp into our business and workflow for the simple fact that all we needed was a cell phone number. All of us have a cell phone number, and with that, we were able to get up and running straightforward. The beauty of it that WhatsApp is cross-platform, so whether we were on an Android phone or an iPhone, it didn't really matter because it was pretty much the same process. Another, another thing that helped WhatsApp integrate itself into our workflow is the fact that it has a, a computer app which allows us to text message and, and work through our desktops uh, through our phone so that we don't necessarily have to be on our phone all day. If you're considering using WhatsApp for your day-to-day -day, uh, workflow, I highly recommend getting the desktop app because it saves a lot of time. You can easily communicate and send messages and photos, even files through WhatsApp uh, desktop app, and it goes straight through your phone and out through uh, your contact list.